your birthday, Noah. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna try milk for the first time. A ver, mi amor, mira. Es lechita. Mira. Tu birthday. He doesn't know. He doesn't know it's like. I know. He thinks it's formula. Tastes different, huh? Yes. Just in case he falls on the back, I'm gonna put a pillow back here. Y'all, yeah, it is no. Oh my god, the fucking camera almost fell! It is Noah's birthday! 
I cannot believe it. I was really struggling this morning because last night I kind of went to sleep really late. Like I have not gone to sleep this late in a while. And I was just like literally fighting my sleep because I was getting Noah's little video ready because I was like, it's his birthday. I have to do a video with like just little clips of, you know, this whole year basically and it came out so beautiful i was emotional i was crying just going down memory lane and i think in general i couldn't sleep because i was just like so emotional and i even ended up decorating like on top of this crib uh, while well, i just put like some balloons that said one and uh this morning i really wanted to wake up before noah so we could surprise him but I went to sleep so late last night, you guys, that I woke up. Noah was already downstairs with Brian. And I was like, oh my goodness, like my plan failed. <laughs> I told Brian, I'm like, it's okay. Like after his first nap, we'll uh, sing happy birthday. And yeah, I think after his first nap, he had breakfast. And then we took him back upstairs. And then we sang happy birthday. And it was the cutest thing ever. I'm still so like shocked that he's one. The solar eclipse is today, which is crazy how his birthday was on the solar eclipse. At first, it was, I thought it was kind of like a bad thing because everybody was freaking out about it. But I'm like, maybe it's a good thing. And I don't know if you guys know this, but Noah was born on Holy Saturday last year, the day before Easter. So he was born on Holy Saturday and his first birthday landed on the solar eclipse. Like, I don't know, guys, that's kind of crazy. But little boy is one already and I cannot believe it, you guys. I was so emotional last night. He was asleep when the clock struck midnight girl <laughs> when I was crying. I could probably add a clip here. I probably won't actually. I don't know how embarrassing it is when I was like sobbing. I was already sobbing girl. Like what is the reason? But because the solar eclipse was today, we really didn't have many plans. And now that the solar solar eclipse happened and didn't even didn't really because I think people were literally freaking out. They didn't know what was going to happen. Now that it passed and we're good. The day is fine. We're actually gonna be doing a little get together. We're gonna make cake, which that was already our plan. We're gonna make cake, the three of us. Well, me and Brian, we're gonna make cake for Noah. And we were just gonna have a chill day. So now I'm like, okay, calling up my family, calling up my suegra. We're like, you guys come over. We're cutting the cake and I'm gonna make pozole. So I gotta go to the store, buy some things. And I'm still not gonna lie, I'm a little tired right now. Like I definitely didn't get my full eight hours. But we're pushing through. It's Noah's birthday. And I'm just so grateful that we have a one-year-old. Like, it's just absolutely crazy. But yeah, I need to post Noah's little birthday pictures. And then I, I'll go to the store. Okay, y'all. I just did my makeup really fast. I'm still in my PJs. But look who got here. Yeah. But Brian Instacarted some things for pozole. So I'm going to make green pozole uh, chicken. I, I love green chicken pozole. So we're going to make that. And that's it, huh? It was very last minute because of this eclipse, girls. So, I mean, yeah. Oh, but Karina brought like cute little. I'm telling you, we don't have a theme for today. Like, we did not know what well, was, was happening. Like, last minute. I mean, he still had, had his birthday party coming up. Yeah. So, Karina got these little dino decorations, and it's crazy because like this? these were the exact ones we used for Brian Zito's birthday. I know. For his second birthday. That's okay. so cute. <laughs> Just a little vibe. I love it. Then I got this little garland. Oh, we could and find it. I, I did here. find these like little like hats. Oh, that's so cute. Little, like birthday hats. Okay, while you do that, I'm gonna start boiling the chicken, girl. All right, y'all. I just changed. We are already making the pozole. We're boiling the chicken. Brian's already air frying the chiles, and hopefully we finish, girl. It's already six thirty. We told yeah. my cuñada and my mom. I'm actually. I don't think I give my mom a time. <laughs> I think I did actually seven. I don't think I'm gonna give my mom a time. But I told them seven, because I was like, we'll be done by then. And it's already 6.30, girl. The chicken's barely boiling. Well, it's almost done, so. Luckily, it's like, really easy to make. Um, oh, and they're decorating. Period. I don't know if this looks random. Just match them up, or if you want to put the I should put cookies on top and then. Yeah, that's cute. Noah. Oh, Noah. It's the cumpleaños, dude. Oh, like, they literally have, hold on, can we talk about this? For Brian's birthday, they literally made the cake because I was like behind right. with the pozole. And the same thing with Noah, like we're repeating the day over again. I'm literally thinking like it's Brian's birthday, like repeat again. It's because y'all, I really wish like I would have had a plan out, but literally, no, man, because people this made it such a big deal, like we, none of us, even no, Karina was going to stay mad. at home, like everybody was going to stay. You guys are still doing his birthday party, this is just like, but like his actual birthday party, like you're fine, you know? No. Yeah. Right. Making the salsa for the pozole. I really wanted to do a TikTok, y'all, but 
literally like <laughs> everybody's hungry already. Uh, whatever. You guys, um, my mom's not here yet, or my suegra. So, which is kind of good because I was kind of freaking out that they were gonna. Uh, this is too much I was kind of freaking out that they would get here before. So it's good that they're not here yet. Babe. You never. We never did the apples. What's that? The apples. That's the salsa. No one. Babe. No one. I put some on the side for Noah and the kids. Let's do it. Okay, we're gonna finally eat. No, oh my god. Tan bueno que le tienes que poner salsa a la Digo, tan bueno que le tienes que poner salsa a la it's so much that I think it's so good. That looks incredible, Mara, even on a Canadian. It's like all like mm -hmm. that looks bomb. <laughs> the yummy chest? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Green, huh? Yeah, it's green and then yellow on the other side. You know what I mean? We're right, Mr. Noah. What's up? Aw, so cute. <gasps> wow! <laughs> Noah, your cake, baby! <laughs> He's like, it's my cake! He's like, it's mine! So cute. Yay! 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 Guys, right here. Noah. 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 Right, take that and the ball pit look right inside the tent. Look, but you see the jumper doesn't fit into the tent. Oh, no. oh my god, it's so cute! All right, try it. Oh my god, I don't even got the like the neck thing. Like, what? Oh, it's so cute. Why? Why is it cheetah? Hello, you guys. Guess who is riding in the front? I was like, you know what? We actually just recently, Brian installed a camera up here in the front and I'm always in the back, always in the back. And today I was like, it just feels right. Noah's already won, like, let me sit in the front. We're watching him, he's doing great. He's doing great. Yeah, it took me a whole year. So earlier you guys saw this was at the house. We were planning like the whole party because we're gonna have it in the backyard. And I'm excited to transform everything. It's gonna be so cute. Lots of planning, lots of planning. We had some unfortunate news like it raining and... Okay, this is when I'm like, I should be in the back. See, this is like, normally I would distract him and I'm like, how do I distract him if I'm in the front? Like, how do you guys do it? Like, for real, what do I do? Am I gonna have to go to the back right now? That's my baby, that's my baby, that's my baby. I feel guilty, but yeah, Luis was over because we were just planning like everything that's gonna go down that day. His birthday party is on Sunday. It is Thursday right now. We couldn't do Saturday because you know Luis has like all these events. So we're doing Sunday, the 14th, and yeah, right now we're on our way to Home Depot. 
Just because... No, I gotta drop off orders first. Oh, actually, Brian's gonna drop off orders. After that, we're going to Home Depot. First of all, I wanna apologize because I know I look so crazy right now. <laughs> but literally, I woke up, was cleaning, and Luis showed up. No. Uh, it's okay, puppy. I just see him on the little camera. I'm just I like... Know. So, within the couple years that we've been living in our house, we've done some changes. We've done like a lot of changes. One thing I have not done that it's been like itching me to do since day, since day one was replacing the dang Imagine lighting Imagine you've door. never farted in the house, you always go outside. Babe, you know? keep us on. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. We have some sliding doors and they're really really uh, on the older side because when they remodeled the kitchen I remember they accidentally had like broken it. That's how like flimsy it was and they ended up fixing it and I just knew like I always want to replace the sliding door with French doors and we already know the doors that we're gonna get they're at Home Depot so we went last night but the lady was like do you want to make sure you know you know what side you're getting because we were like a little bit confused of like what way it opened so she was like I recommend you come tomorrow because we're already gonna close she's like I recommend you guys come tomorrow and just ask and really see like what you're getting because you don't want to get the wrong door with like the wrong side that opens so I was like okay it's because you know what when we went to Home Depot the door they have an uh, LH or R8 but like if you look at the design of the door like how it actually looks like I don't know it was yeah, just because so weird I think they're referring to if you're from looking the at outside. it from the outside which was confusing me because when i think of like the french door am i going to open it from the left side or the right side i'm naturally thinking from the inside from the inside but the way that it was like the image was it was showing it from the outside because the door was something out yeah so we were getting confused with that and i even told brian i'm like i have a feeling we're looking at it wrong and it, they're referring to it from outside and I, I knew it because i even like physically saw the doors but the lady was like just just come tomorrow you guys seem like you, you still don't know exactly what you want and i was like Ooh. it's because i think she was also frustrated that they were closing and i was like let's no. just come tomorrow well that and then she was just a service rep kind of thing like she didn't really she, know she's not she's not from that department Aquí estoy, mi amor. That's my baby. That's my baby. That's my baby. Okay, I'm definitely, once we get to the post office, going to the back because it's not right that I'm here. right now um hi so we actually went to home depot yesterday because we got a french patio door so we have a sliding door and it's literally just i knew from like the beginning when we bought this house that we were going to replace it let me show you because it's kind of old this is the patio door you could just tell it's older because it even like is stained i have gone in there to like clean it and it just is something that you kind of had to just either paint, but I just wanted to replace it overall. So this is a door right here. We're replacing it to French doors, which they're so cute. I'm excited. We actually have the door in the truck right now. This house was built 1989. I have a feeling this door has been here since, since then, girl, because I don't know, you could just like tell. You could just tell like it's like stained no matter how much i go in there and try to clean like it's just really old and it has gotten stuck multiple times like when trying to open it so in general i'm like i didn't want to go with a sliding door because i feel like that does become a problem with time so they're gonna come and replace this it might get a little hectic in here they should be coming soon i even took brian Zito's pictures down just because i was told they're gonna probably have to break through the wall so yeah okay i already got ready i did a simple little makeup look it is friday noah's birthday is this sunday well his birthday party yeah. yeah party birthday party oh the guy that's playing the door he's still not here yet so we're just kind of waiting on him that way we can actually go out and run errands because i don't know how long it's gonna take to put the door brian already brought the door he borrowed raul's truck and it's like 
still in the parking just there chilling i oh my god this morning i was kind of freaking out because his birthday party is this sunday and i didn't have an outfit but i already ordered everything and it's getting out here tomorrow so yay i'm excited like literally the outfit is down to the t with what i wanted so i hope that everything looks the way i hope it does like in my head <laughs> Listen, I'm just glad I got Noah's outfit on time. I ordered his because it was like personalized on Etsy. I got it in yesterday. So I'm just glad I got that. That was the most important thing. And then my outfit, I'm just glad I found literally everything I was looking for. But yeah, I just in general, I need to go buy some boots. His birthday party is going to be safari theme, like wild one. So I just want to get some boots to pair with like my outfit. <laughs> Come here. Say hi to the camera, Mira. Yeah. Say hi. Dile. Sí, sí, mira. Dile. Hola. Tengo un año. <laughs> Noah, that's the one thing that the only thing that makes me so sad about him turning one that he's not considered like a baby anymore. I'm like he is my baby. He is my baby. You're always gonna be my baby. This is literally the door that we're gonna about to put in, and I had to put my jacket under this because it like didn't reach. Y'all can kind of see, but um, yeah. I just got a package from Amazon and I ordered a couple door handles Oops, yesterday. Hold on, hold on. I had to order a door handle for the French door. Ooh. Yep, this is it. Ooh, I also ordered her front door because the front door never mm -hmm. had like. It's funny, like, what a birthday party will have you do, like, certain little things that you've been wanting to finish. You're like, just finish them now. But <laughs> we're also putting different front door handles. The front door handles are so cute, you guys. So we are going to be installing these. I think maybe not today, but tomorrow. And look how pretty the handles are from the inside. Those, those are the front ones? Yeah. I wanted the, because I was like, I want to match the front to the back. But I'm like, no, the back should be like more subtle. And I was like, the front door should have like the statement. So this is like the difference. It's like more simple for the French door. I didn't want to go too modern either. But look, this is like front door vibes, backyard vibes. I don't know. I feel like I'm not like too modern modern when it comes to like my decor. So I don't want to do like such like a modern door handle. I went more traditional. This is going to be what's like on the outside of the back door. Very like traditional. It's cute. It's gold. And the front door is, I guess like more modern, but not so, so modern. I guess, yeah, like modern with like the vibe but it is a front door so i didn't mind doing like a statement look how beautiful babe the guys are here it's actually it looks they removed that so quick that door right. okay y'all the door is installed Yay! Now, let me show you from outside. I love how the handles look. Ooh! So pretty! Okay. It is crazy, like, what a door does. I, it completely transformed it. Like, it looks so good. Um, but right now, we have to go to the store to buy the alcohol that we're going to need for Sunday. And somebody dropped off some hibachi at Karina's that we're going to go pick up. So I'm excited. I'm so hungry. It just sounds so good. But yeah, you guys, I freaking love the door. Let's, let's vlog in front of it. <sighs> like... Are you kidding? It looks so cute. Hopefully, like one of these days, I mean, for sure after the party, we could paint it. I feel like I'm like in a new house. Like I told Brandon, I'm like, we're gonna feel like we're in a new house with just with this little change. I love it. You guys, we came to the store to grab the alcohol for Sunday. We're at Ralph's. And Lisa's gonna come by tonight and drop some stuff off. But our bartender gave us a list of alcohol we need to purchase. And Mr. Noah is knocked out. Look who woke up. <laughs> you look what I saw. <laughs> got the goods. We got actually some <laughs> eggs, coffee, some of just my go to breakfast, and all the alcohol that we're going to need. Ooh, and some Olipops. 
Wow. We're getting home and we literally is pulling up. What is that? Palm trees. Oh my god, not the palm trees. That is so cute. <laughs> like a lot of greens. Y'all, the jungle is here, eh? No, literally. So, Maya, mañana, mañana, saca todo, todo de las bolsas just so it's ready to go. And I have tons of these looking around. It's actually a really cool look. 